And my next question, uh, what kind of nudes should we be sending to the aliens? So we talked about NASA is launching nude pictures of humans to space in hope of attracting aliens. I mean, we should be just sending only asshole pics since they look like a celestial vortex. Do you know what vortex? I would send out? I would send out a picture of just a cock with the huge... Huge fucking wart right on the tip of it. <laughs> and just like, this is what human peepees look like. The best is that they're just going to send that black guy wood. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, he's yeah, just going to be leaning over with his giant Duraflame log. But it also makes me question NASA. Who the fuck is sitting down at NASA? Yeah, like what? Incels. How could he attract? <laughs> Why would that Former Nazis. <laughs> I don't get it. Like, what would they... I don't understand why they would... Do that, like aliens are going to see what? Because I guess, like, if from a th serious point of view, they want us to see like what our anatomy looks like and see if aliens are interested I, in I it. I think that is it. So it's like it's similar to how we would maybe look at a tiger cross-eyed if it was wearing a necktie. Got like it. that's similar to like, hey, we want to see what the animal is, Got what it. the being is, without the dressings of society. I mean, in that respect, I get it. But it's also I love how somebody's just promoting Bad Bunny's album in Spanish <laughs> on the comments. Like, album, album de Bad de Bunny. Que se yo dan todos los demás Bad Bunny da King. That was good. So whose nude would you want shot into space to represent male and female? I mean, I think like a perfect, I would say a perfect male body would be someone like a Charlie Hunnam. Like yeah. just like, like literally like from an anatomical Boogie point of Nights, view. Boogie Nights, Mark Wahlberg. Boogie Nights, Mark Wahlberg yeah. is good. I want to want to send like a fat, I, you have to send not someone too jacked, not someone too fat. Like you want to say this is anatomically what we have, which is. Perfect. Ba basic. Basic. Like a basic But a body. woman, who's a woman? Who's, because Salma Hayek, she's too busty. Melissa well, McCarthy. Yeah, yeah. Melissa McCarthy is a good one. I would send her <laughs> as the man. Um, um, but there aren't any, like, there's not many famous plain Janes. You know, like famous, like, ah, you know what? And this, this sounds she, awful, even though I consider her beautiful. But like somebody like Emma Stone. Right? Emma who's, Stone. Who's, who's really beautiful, but also looks like a human being. Or honestly, why not? To just make it simple, to just make it simple, and to also show how much, you know, humans, how kind of um, versatile we are, and to save pictures, why don't we just send one of Ellen Page, one of Elliot Page? I fucking knew you were going to <laughs> I literally <laughs> smiled the minute you said versatility. I was like, I know exactly I mean, where this is she going. She has a perfect woman's body <laughs> yeah. and now a perfect yeah. man's body. Pull up Ellen Page, female body. I mean, because what we're You're talking smoke, about yeah. is, you know, you know, uh, you know, small enough, perky enough boobs. Look, perfect woman's body. Ellen, yeah, yeah look yeah. at that. Why can't that be? Dude, she genuinely in 2021 looks like Pee Wee Herman. Um, <laughs> I mean, she. Looks I don't a mean lot. that as a diss. I'm just saying, like that's. She what looks I would a say. lot like Pete Davidson. She does look like Pete oh, Davidson. Like she actually Dude, does. If Ellen Page, if Elliot Page doesn't play Pete Davidson <laughs> in the movie about Pete Davidson's life, then nothing's fair. Like genuinely, <laughs> nothing in life is fair. Um, so, but, but would you want NASA canceled if they don't shoot up a transgender nude? <laughs> Yeah, I think so. You're such a shit stirrer. <laughs> 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 <We> <laughs>